Hi everybody, I'm going to be reading you a book called Five Minutes Peace by Jill Murphy. The children were having breakfast. This was not a pleasant sight. Miss Large took a tray from the cupboard. She set it with a teapot, a milk jug, a, her favorite cup and saucer, a plate of marmalade, toast, and leftover cake from yesterday. She stuffed the morning paper into her pocket and sneaked off toward the door. Where are you going with that tray, Mom? asked Laura. To the bathroom, said Miss Large. Why? asked the other two children. Because I want five minutes peace from all of you, said Miss Large. That's why. Can we come? asked Lester as they trailed up the stairs behind her. No, said Miss Large. You can't. What shall we do then? asked Laura. You can play, said Miss Large, downstairs by yourselves and keep an eye on the baby. I'm not a baby, muttered the little one. Miss Large ran a deep hot bath. She emptied half the bottle of bubble bath into the water, plunked on her shower cap, and got in. She poured herself a cup of tea and laid back with her eyes closed. It was heaven. Can I play you my tune? asked Lester. Miss Large opened one eye. Must you? she asked. I've been practicing, said Lester. You told me to. Can I, please, just for one minute? Go on then, sighed Miss Large. So Lester played. He played Twinkle Twinkle Little Star three and a half times. In came Laura. Can I read you a page from my reading book? She asked. No, Laura, said Miss Large. Go on, all of you, off downstairs. You let Lester play his tune, said Laura. I heard. You like him better than me. It's not fair. Oh, don't be silly, Laura, said Miss Large. Go on then, just one page. So Laura read. She read four and a half pages of Little Red Riding Hood. In came the little one with a, a trunk full of toys. For you, he beamed, flinging them all into the bath water. Thank you, dear, said Miss Large weakly. Can I see the cartoons in the paper? asked Laura. Can I have the cake? asked Lester. Can I get in with you? asked the little one. Miss Large groaned. In the end, they all got in. The little one was in such a hurry that he forgot to take off his pajamas. Miss Large got out, of, got out. She dried herself, put on her bathrobe, and headed for the door. Where are you going now, Mom? asked Laura. To the kitchen, said Miss Large. Why? asked Lester. Because I want five minutes peace. From all of you, said Miss Large. That's why. And off she went downstairs where she had three minutes and 45 seconds of peace before they all came to join her. The end. I hope you all are doing good. Bye.